how is it going guys and welcome back to the channel now <laughs> i've got a new car already uh only took me a week um it took me a while to decide on what car i wanted um what i wanted to go for i went i, I looked at quite a significant amount and but what this car i've brought or i've had before um <laughs> in fact i've had two of them before and no it's not a Vauxhall. i've gone to the dark side guys uh <laughs> i'm just grinning looking at it <laughs> i can't believe i've got another one i really can't but the soundtrack for the exhaust noise from this car is a spot on um yeah it, i got it quite cheap as well um for obvious reasons which i'll explain when you go see the car but i am chuffed to bits guys i am chuffed to bits like like with a Civic, um, I locked the car, but it just had to wring its neck, and I wasn't really a fan of it. But um, I can't stop smiling. I'm just looking at it. <laughs> I'm over the over the moon with it. Uh, obviously, I'm. It's <laughs> a lot of you guys aren't going to like it. I don't think because um, I've gone to the dark side. So you probably think I'm a traitor. But I've got to do what's best for me. Um, the Civic, when I bought that, I did. I liked it, I wanted it, but it was mainly for the channel, for the Honda content, for the uh, to try and dip into that sort of side of the YouTubing. But I, I just couldn't get on with it, which is why it only lasted three months. But yeah, guys, um, I'll uh, swing around now to the, um, to the the little walk around videos I've done of it, and uh, hopefully you guys approve. I really do, because I really approve of it. So let's crack on. <laughs> So there you have it guys, it's a Ford Focus ST. <laughs> um, yes, like I said, I've had two of these before. Um, it's a 2005 by 54 of play and I did get it really cheap. I was quite surprised at how like, cheap these cars have gone. Um, but yeah, it's modification wise, it's obviously got wheels, it's got H&R springs, um, it's got a cat back exhaust, which I'm not quite sure what brand it is. Um, engine wise, it's had, it's had a few little, well I'll say little bits, it's, um, so it's got this can and filter which I am going to change. Um, it's got a few like these hoses, coolant hoses down here. Uh, I'm not too sure what brand they are. I'll have to quick look at the receipts. There's a, there is a lot of receipts for it, like, like a wedge like that. It's had a lot of money spent on it. Um, but like I said, I'm not going to go. How, I'm not going to say how cheap I got it, but I did get it really cheap, mainly because if you guys know these cars, they do suffer with lack of peel. The orange is renowned for it. I, I looked at facelift ones that were up for six, seven grand and even they had lack of peel, but mainly along the bonnet and the roof. Whereas this one, bonnet's fine, the roof's fine, but it's got it along here and underneath here on both sides and a bit on the spoiler. Um, yes, yeah, it's the same as this side. It's hard, I suppose you can't really see on camera. 
but it, it's along here and it's along here that is it for the lacquer peel there's it's, it's nowhere else it's literally on the on the spoiler on the uh underneath the windows and along that pillar there that's that is it there's nothing on the roof there's nothing on the bonnet it's had paint um which you can you can sort of see not so much in camera but you can, you can tell it's been painted so it's a, there's a couple of different shades i'm pretty sure these i think there's like six or seven shades of orange i think feel free to correct me if you know more about these than me uh, but yeah other than that it's all right we're also um it's got a couple of little rare options on it um oh, up if i uh, unlocked it, wasn't it well double unlocked it there we go i've locked it I still get used to it guys bear with um yeah so look it's got dual climate control which in all fairness, I didn't even know this, these cars came with. Obviously, it's had a different gear knob on it with a, a Gator, ST Gator. The, st uh, the seats are okay, that they need a good scrub. Also, another, another option that's quite rare on these is it has a spare wheel, which again, the, the, fir the first two cars I've had of these, the two um, Focuses, um, I've it usually just got a can of a uh, tire weld and a pump in the back. That's what you got. You didn't get a spare wheel, and I've never had uh, dual climate control. Both of these I've had um, didn't have dual climate control. It's just a normal, you know, fans, switches, and stuff like that. So that that's nice. But yeah, I did get it really cheap, guys. Like I said, I'm not gonna say how cheap I got it, but I got an absolute bargain. Like shout out to the guy who um, who sold it. Me, nice one to you, mate. Um, plans for it at the minute. Um, I do want to get a full exhaust system just to. You know, just to uh, make it like give it the true four pot sound, the four pot, five pot, five pot sound, <laughs> five pot sound. Um, cause it is, even though it's got some unknown system on it, I don't know what system's on it actually. Um, but it's definitely not a standard one. You can see from the tailpipes how big they are. That's that's not standard. Um, and I can't find anything in the receipts to say what exhaust is on it. Obviously, the K and M filter that's got. Um, Look at the receipts, it's got um, the little sock on the end of the filter. Can't really see it, it, go, it goes sort of like down there behind, behind here. But I do want one of them that come from here and sort of sit here, like the crossover ones. Get rid of all that. But yeah, guys, I'm, um, I'm chuffed to bits of it. Obviously, I'm, I want to put the, the, the later version 07 onwards headlights, so the black, the black headlights, sort of black of um, sort of, oh, you know what I mean, guys. So this chrome isn't chrome, it's black. You guys know what I mean. But yeah, at the minute, I'm just going to drive it for a few weeks um, just to sort of get rid of my paranoia about cars. Um, I I'll I'll drove 120 miles or 130 miles to get this. Um, it was an absolute, took over three hours. Uh, shout out to Ash from Master Mods and Tyler for coming up with me and, you know, helping me get it and bring it back. So yeah, I think if it's going to be a problem, I'd have known by that. Driving 120, 130 miles all the way back, the car didn't skip a beat started up first time this morning no cold start issues it's obviously I, ch I checked the coolant and the oil when i got home just to make sure that it hadn't dropped and it hadn't but yeah so it's, it seems it seems a good base to start from it's had a lot of work it's had a clutch the clutch done the block mod hasn't been done but it's running standard power it's not mapped or anything like that it's literally exhaust and filter and that is it which is uh, the way i like things i'm you know because i like to try and find the car as stock as possible Unfortunately, a lot of these have been modified and the ones that were stuck were just absolute wrecks. So this is the sort of meet in the middle sort of thing. Yeah, it's got problems with the bodywork, but it's it's relatively tidy, really. It, it passes a five foot test, so to speak. So yeah, that is the new car, guys. Uh, let me know what you think. Like I said, a lot of you are gonna hate it because I've gone to Ford and you're gonna go, oh, Fords are slow and you know, oh, my, my VX, I can kill a Ford Focus. Guys, you know how I drive. That's another reason I think not the Civic. I don't drive cars hard. I don't smash the life out of them. This is perfect for me. Nice little cruise if you want it to be. And I put my foot down. Feels so much faster than the Civic. Night and day. It really does. But yeah, um, so that is it for this, guys. Um, I'm going to stop waffling on now. Let me know what you got in the comments, what you guys think. You know, Do you hate it? Do you like it? I imagine a lot of you hate it. But I can't please everybody, unfortunately. I've got to do what's best for me. Um, I love these cars. And you know, I, I will carry on making content as best I can. And hopefully you guys enjoy it. So as always, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you on the next one.